wife firmly believe in, in mulligans on the first hole? Yeah, absolutely, All right. 100%. So we'll start with that. Yeah. Did you do any warm-ups to this event? Um, I, I hit some golf balls this past week to try, okay. to try to get it right a little bit. So if you beat me, then it's going to be a complete humiliation because I've played mo most of the summer. Yeah, but I think, uh, I don't know, we'll let the first tee kind of see how, see how this round's going to go. Right, just take it yeah. easy on the old man. All right. Good ball. Fairway on the first one is always good. That's a great start, yeah. I'm more trying to keep it off the road over here. <laughs> oh, there we go. Good uh, start. This is not going to be fun. This is, <laughs> this is going to be torture. That's a great ball. Appreciate it. Yeah. Beauty. So how long were you in Lexington? Uh, lived there for five years, but we go back like every summer. Right. And then was in Arizona after that, which there's a ton of golf there. Right. So we played uh, quite a bit. So yeah. that's why you have that natural swing you started yeah. playing as a kid. Yeah, I guess so, yeah. After you finish your basketball career, go with the, uh, the senior tour? Um, <laughs> I don't think I'd make the senior tour, but I'd play a ton, I think. You could be the tallest uh, ever yeah. to appear in a senior event. I could just, uh, that'd be a pretty fun round to go, just take all the basketball effort over there. Here's the ball I think that, that he outdrove me by 50 yards, but no, this is not the ball. This is a practice ball from the Rangers over there. That's his ball up there, about 150 yards ahead of mine. <laughs> So my ego is already <laughs> shattered. <laughs> nice. Sit that pretty thin. Sit. If I have to say this after every good shot, good shot, Luke. Thanks. Good shot, Luke. This is going to be <laughs> just a, a. Hopefully, we can wear that out today. Yeah. <laughs> I should put on my golf announcing voice. Luke Cornett, putting for birdie on the first hole. Oh. Not bad. Take it. Are you into gimmies? I, I do believe in gimmies. Uh, I, I do too. All right. Is this qualifying? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Besides basketball, what's the best thing you did this summer? Um, <laughs> well, I got engaged. So really? that definitely takes the cake. Yeah. When? I would be in trouble if I said otherwise. Uh, it was. The fact that you uh, hesitated, early, you're in trouble already? Yeah, it was early in the summer. <laughs> uh, I was actually went in, uh, in the city in a Central Park and found a spot, and so that oh, was... Oh, you're the romantic type. Congra um, that's great. I'm Congratulations. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. Is this a high school sweetheart, met in college? Uh, met in college. We've been dating for uh, a little over three years. So how'd nice. you do it? Um, well, we were going out for dinner was the thing. I was like, oh, no, we got here a little early. Let's go take a stroll type of deal. So we walked out into Central Park and I yeah, got on the knee and asked. Um, it was... She was very... Uh, I don't know. I don't even know if excited is the right term. It was just like kind of a rush where she says she doesn't even really remember anything. Of course, but, it's uh, one of the biggest days of your life. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I just tried to not stumble over my words too much, which luckily she doesn't even remember if I did or not. <laughs> right, so I'm didn't, not even sure. It didn't matter. <laughs> yeah. So last year, one of my favorite parts of the season was that game in Toronto. Yeah. And not necessarily, I mean, part of it to see how well you played. It was your NBA debut but it was watching your mom and dad in the stands. Yeah. Well, first off, what do you remember about the game? When I checked in, I had trouble getting the breakaway pants off. <laughs> and honestly, I was sitting there for like an extra minute and the rest were kind of like, come on, we need to get here. And, but like they were brand new, so they were like really connected well. So like that actually kind of took the edge off though a little bit, because I was just like freaking out about that. The second I got them off, it was like checking in on a free throw. I was like, thank the Lord that's over with. <laughs> and then, uh, I mean that, I honestly don't really remember too much of it. It was kind of one of the games where you're just reacting and playing where you don't even know what's going on, which is actually the best kind of way to play. Kind of like the marriage proposal. Yeah, right, yeah exactly. Thing. It's just like uh, your instincts take over. At your very best when you're playing, what was your lowest handicap? Um, I mean, I, 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 could, I could consistently go like probably like 81, 82 right. is what I was like. In high school? Yeah. Right. Yeah, that was the best it ever got. Oh, that came out bad. That's... <laughs> oh. All right, we're going to get to see your sand game. Yeah, we did, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not Ooh. so nice. Camera crew. All right, young guys. Yep. Breaks the trap. Uh. Good ball. I can't see that far. <laughs> did it come down yet? Yeah. That's a nice ball. Oh, yeah. Good ball. That was that's nice. Nice, yeah, that's a nice one. I got a good ball from Luke. Yes. 
Bang. Nice. Oh, no. <laughs> Nicely done, Luke. Thank you. Now, I never understood the, the, uh, this particular part that when the round is over, you're supposed to take your hat off. I yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Anyway, hey, hat, yeah. that was really fun. Hey, great to play with you. Um, I don't want to play you once you start playing more and getting in practice because, gotcha. man, you've got that natural swing that your coach <laughs> talked about years ago. Yeah. So that was, that was great. You. Next time, though, you're giving me more shots. <laughs> I don't we know. It might have ended up pretty. We didn't play with full handicaps today. Yeah. <laughs>